Today, we're stopping in at the Newport Car Museum, located in Portsmouth, Rhode Island, just north of scenic downtown Newport. Once a month, the museum hosts a Hoods Up event, showcasing the muscle behind the magic of each of the iconic cars they have on display. My name is Vincent Moretti. I'm a manager here at the Newport Car Museum. I think people have a, a, a notion of what a car museum is, and that notion is cars are lined up, they have ropes around them, it it's a, could be a cold and dingy type of place. We are an art museum. We do display without ropes, without any encumbrances around the car. So we appreciate everything to do with the car. One weekend a month, usually the second weekend, weekend of the month, we have hoods up because the engines in these cars are as beautiful as the car itself. And they're as pristine as the car itself. Uh, being a native of this area myself, uh, we, we've been really deprived as car people, passionate car people in this part of the country. This is the very first time we've had anything at this level. Such a diverse collection, everything from a 54 Kaiser Darren to a 2019 Corvette. So, and just about everything in between. So I think there's something here to please everyone. Well, we're standing here in the World Car Galleries. It's everything from outside the United States is represented. Not everything, but things from outside the United States. Jaguars, Porsches, uh, Mercedes. To my back here are Corvettes. We have one of each, or maybe two of each year of Corvette, an iteration of Corvettes. And then we have what we call the Mopar gallery, which is basically high-performance Chrysler products. We also have the thin cars of the 50s, represent from 1954 through 1958. Further down is Shelby, anything to do with Carroll Shelby, um, including the GT40s from Le Mans era through Shelby Mustangs to Cobras in the Shelby area. It's, it's not unusual to have someone that has no car at all in them spend two, three hours here. Because of the color, the way they're displayed, again, the music, the videos, um, the fact that we have driving simulators that the kids love, um, there's plenty for kids to do. People that are not car people come in here and enjoy what they see. I highly recommend to come to Rhode Island. Up next, it's Hot Rod Heaven in Lincoln, Nebraska. When Driven continues. <laughs>